I want to see what's under there and what's going on with this drain. Hello, I'm Lewis and this is The Renovation Project. In October 2022, my partner and I bought a stone-built house in northern France. The house has relatively severe problems with moisture, so we are currently assessing and planning the drainage at the exterior of the property, which has actually led us back inside and specifically to this corner. This section of the house was like this when we bought it. The attic floor is rotten from water damage, but since this occurred, the, the roof's been replaced over the front aspect. I think that the interior was stripped back and removed because of excessive moisture damage. I also think it wasn't just because of the roof. There's patches of salt crystals on the wall left by the evaporating moisture. In the back of the room, there are more salts on the natural rock that the walls rest upon. The base of the room literally having been chiseled out of the rock. And if you've been following our channel, you'll know that we have some issues out the back here. <clears throat> this is the hole. If you want to see more about the hole, check out our other video, the first video. It's there or there, the link. Have a look at that. But I'll just, I'll give you a quick recap on here of what we've got at the back of the house. A drain here which is literally, again, like the floor in there, it's carved out of the natural rock. It's literally a channel through the natural rock. And in there is uh, an old well or a water collection system. So the water disappears down a drain there. There is a defunct pipe that enters here, but I'm pretty sure there's a relatively newer drain under here. You can see the watermark here because the ground is really wet. Digging down, what, six inches, something. There is the pipe coming from the exterior drain. It's got another angled joint on it and then it's got gravel around it. Everything's pretty wet. And then it goes into a corrugated tube there with, holy shit. Excuse my language. It's a perforated pipe. The sort that you would use for a land drain or a French drain. It's got holes in it. Has it? It looks like it's a perforated pipe, which to me seems Crazy. Our drain, let's have a look. So you can clearly see the perforations 
and it's sat in a base of gravel, which is pretty wet. It comes in and turns a little, and I'm assuming it goes under all this stuff that we've got here, and then out to the front and uh, onto the street. So what have I discovered today? So I've discovered that we have a land drain running through one part of our property. We've also researched it and uh, discovered it's part of what's called an hérisson system. Hérisson is French for hedgehog. I'm not quite sure of the link there, but it's a system of a land drain below a property to take water away from the property in the event of flooding or just natural uh, moisture that comes out of the land below a stone built building such as this. I've also rediscovered my vast lack of knowledge when it comes to uh, the renovation of a stone building like this but that's not a problem because we are just in the discovery phase so a lot of what we're doing now is just looking at the property and understanding what are the fundamental things we need to deal with before we start getting on and, and renovating. Because of that, we will be consulting professionals when we need to, and we will be consulting professionals for the situation here and for the drainage at the back as well. We also read all the comments that people post on the videos and they're really helpful and they open doors to new avenues uh, that we maybe hadn't thought of before. So even though it's a bit strange to find a drain under our house, which is connected to the outside and which is also an outside that is full of water and that water is entering the house traversing the house and exiting the front, but it's doing that through a perforated pipe. Seems quite bizarre to me, but I'll keep an open mind. If you've made it this far, please give us a like, and uh, we'd love it if you did subscribe as well and follow us on our crazy renovation journey, which has only just begun. Thanks for watching. Cheers. <laughs>